week after the ABC 70. Now, 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 look at this, y'all. <clears throat> look at this. Um, I seen this report. They, this is the second report they doing. This is the second report. I'm going to let y'all listen to this and I'm going to talk about it. But this is just wasted taxpaying dollars. They done already said that it cost $10 million, man. $10 million of, of your taxpaying dollars is going down the drain. Just look at this, man. News I team uncovered millions of dollars in PPE sitting in the rain in San Mateo County, a familiar site in San Benito County now. Thousands more boxes of PPE not only sitting outside in unwieldy stacks, but heading to the recycling center to be shredded. So what in the world is going on? ABC 7 News I team reporter Dan Noyes is back with an update to his exclusive investigation. Dan? Dan, our investigation from last week is getting a huge reaction across the country. More than 600,000 views on TikTok alone. I received many comments on the report, but also tips to investigate. Luke Markham and his wife saw something familiar in last week's I-Team report from San Mateo County, showing all that PPE, including hospital gowns, sitting in the rain. Hospital gowns in all different sizes. Here's size M. There's large. And, of course, here's double XL. She's watching the video, and it's the same company, ICU Eyewear Corporation. She says, Luke, that's the same company as over on Sheldon Drive. If they're letting it sit out in the rain in San Mateo, what's going on over on Sheldon Drive? The Markhams messaged me, so I met them in Hollister yesterday, went to the ICU eyewear warehouse, and found this. Thousands of boxes of PPE stacked high, containing millions of plastic face shields. Some of the columns on the verge of collapsing, and forklifts loading them onto flatbeds. I followed the trucks to a nearby recycling center and saw the face shields going to the shredder. To throw away PPE? That's outrageous. Yes, I'm a is. COVID survivor. This is a still a pandemic. We are going into year number three. <laughs> this is not okay. Markham took his complaint to his county. Oh, man. Y'all, I told y'all the word is a Truman show. It's just one big ass joke. They don't give a damn about none of that crap. COVID-25. Supervisor, B. Gonzalez is the board's chair. I discovered that these masks were being destroyed at the request of the federal government. Why would the federal government... What? what? ...being destroyed at the request of the federal government. The federal what? That these masks were being destroyed at the request of the federal government. Why would the federal... So, so, so hold up. So, which is it? Do y'all want us to wear the mask, or are you just going to destroy the mask? ...government be requiring this county and this business to destroy face shields in a pandemic? That I couldn't answer you. And as I said, there's more questions that are answers. Um, and the further questions we ask, the bigger the hole gets. ICU Eyewear CEO Kirk Hobbs declined to be interviewed on camera. You hear what she said? The bigger the bigger, the bigger the hole gets, the more questions we ask. Because you know why? Because that's what happens when you go down a rabbit hole, baby, baby. The moment you take that motherfucking red black pill and you continue to ask questions, 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 ask questions before you know you deep, 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 deep in the in the darkness. Deep down a rabbit hole. You don't even see the light no more. You deep. I'm still in the rabbit hole. I'm not on it's all darkness. I'm still asking questions. It's getting deeper and deeper and deeper. Or have a recorded phone conversation. He told me today the face. Be I said there's more questions that are face shields in a pandemic. That I couldn't answer you. And as I said, there's more questions that are answers. Um, and the further questions we ask, the bigger the hole gets. ICU Eyewear CEO Kirk Hobbs declined to be interviewed on camera or have a recorded phone conversation. He told me today the face shields are not being shredded on orders of the federal government. Hobbs says there was no market for them and that a staff looked for some place to donate the face shields but failed. I understand how bad this looks, he said. Optically, how wasteful this is. We didn't come to this place without trying. We put in a great deal of effort to find a place where they can be used. Supervisor Gonzalez is concerned about PPE being destroyed and about the impact on the county's landfill. We have an issue right now with our landfill in that we are in near the 15-year life capacity. So does this refuse that's being put into our landfill 
does it belong somewhere else and not in San Mateo County? By shredding all that, Hobbs also told me ICU, ICU will be able to recoup some of the tariffs they paid to import the face shields from China. The story tips are coming in. Now, tomorrow, more PPEs, thousands of boxes sitting outside in yet another location. And if you have something that we should investigate, call me at one yeah. 888 I got something. I'm going to call y'all. We're going to let's investigate some about some gang stalking. How about right. that? Cause, you know, somebody, somebody watch some, look, somebody call that damn number. We should investigate. You guys, you just heard the dude. If you want something to talk about, go ahead and call that number. And see, I might even do it, y'all. Somebody else don't wait on me, though. You do it, too. But look, this whole, whole vid 25 is a joke, man. All they doing is just destroying and wasting money. That's all they doing. And then you walk out the door, you see... Face masks is just laying all on the ground anyway. You just destroying the plant. They yo, the beast came to kill, still to destroy. Ain't that what the scripture says? You just destroying Mother Nature, destroying the planet with everything. More pollution. More, more, more trash. How much trash we gonna have on the planet? Man, I hope we got these trash ass people. I rest my case, Your Honor.